Hello class. So, Carl is here. Hello. So, what I want to talk about is the excitement of what competitive gaming is, right? Um, if a lot of you don't know it, um, there have been a lot of tournaments out there, not only for shooters or even like, you know, um, League of Legends, but there has been some, and a lot I mean, uh, for fighting games. I myself actually play Street Fighter as a side a hobby, but I actually do play competitively. I actually go to Toronto, uh, Mississauga, Oakville for tournaments that actually come in. Um, I, not too long ago, was actually at a tournament over in Toronto for Canada Cup. And if not a lot of you know about it, it's actually one of uh, Toronto's top um, tournament com uh, communities where players from not only the States, but even from Japan, China, or them, will come here and compete. Uh, a, lot of the, a lot of the prices are actually real money. So we actually like go all out on these. Uh, what I am showing you right now is on this side, I guess, or this side, whichever I like to show it, um, are actual clips from not only online, but from local tournaments that I've been to. Um, I just want to show you that um, the competitive gaming can actually give you an excitement. If you're very into it, um, that's awesome. Those are haven't. Take the time to actually check these out. You'll actually be surprised like how dedicated these people will get to, um, or even how passionate the gaming community could go towards these types of fighting games. I love them to death, and I'm not lying to you there. I actually take the time to not only practice on my spare time, but I also love to uh, teach others that actually want to try to get into the game. Uh, and always like to take in new challenges, whoever see my videos. I actually do post them over on Twitch and over on YouTube. So if you'd like to check them out, see boo boo 66 type that on YouTube, and you'll see all my videos. If not, then PS4 and Xbox One. Enjoy the stuff.